Hey Bethel, hope you're having a great week. I'm gonna be helping out with our update video and we just have a few announcements and starting off, we are starting a new curriculum for our kids on September 12th, along with a bunch of other new ministries and old ministries that are re-kicking off this year. And so our first um, series is Pick Your Own Adventure, Pick Your Own Path. It's from Psalms and Proverbs and I'm really excited for you guys to get to experience it and to meet some of our kids for the first time because I know some of you are have been away on vacation. So starting on September 12th, our kids will be going downstairs during our connect time, just like we used to do in the past. And they'll be breaking off into different small groups based on age ranges. And we will also be doing some large group time, some fun activities, and then ending again in those small groups where you'll be able to pick them up and drop them off from. So because we are changing how our Sunday school works, that means I'm gonna need a lot more volunteers. I'm gonna need about 30 more volunteers to make our kids program flourish. And so I need some volunteers that are gonna to wanna to lead small group time. So you'll be leading um, like 15, 20 minute groups of 10 kids of different age ranges and talking about the Bible story and praying with them. I'm gonna need people who wanna lead large groups. So that would look like acting different things and talking to 50 groups of kids at a time. I need people who are passionate about our toddlers and infants who wanna spend a whole day just cuddling and snuggling with babies. I need people who maybe you wanna help our Sunday school program, but you're not great with kids. I need some security members. So you're down there making sure that everyone is safe the whole time. I need people who wanna work with our pre-K kids and our K kids, our kindergarten kids. So that's the whole time teaching them about Jesus and having a lot of playtime. If you feel like you could help out with any of these areas or you wanna know more, send me an email at jesse at discover Bethel. And I'm also gonna have a sign up sheet at the back of the church this Sunday. Hey parents, we wanna get a sense of how many kids are gonna be joining us in person starting in September and what your comfort levels are when joining us. So down below, we are linking a survey so you can tell us how many kids you have, what their age regions are, and what your comfort levels are. And we're also gonna be emailing that out on Friday. So let me know. You can email me or give me a call during office hours at the church. Thanks, Jesse. I just wanna echo some of the things that Jesse was just saying. We're very excited about our plans for Bethel Kids this, this fall, uh, but we really need your help to be part of this, to make this what we want it to be. We also wanna hear your voice about how you're feeling as families at home and what you need and how we can partner with you in that. And we hope that part of that is joining together in worship because it's a way in which we all become more like Christ, committing and setting that time aside. I have a few announcements I also wanna share with you. The first is I just wanna make sure you're following our podcast. Our Meet the Family podcast series that we started a few weeks ago. We had a new episode up this past week with Christina Patterson talking about Hearts Exchange, which is a really great resource for people interested in investing time and learning about indigenous ministry. I would encourage you to listen to that and let us know if you wanna be part of that program. I think it would definitely be worth your while. I also wanna give everyone some updates about our back to school drives we've been doing at Bethel. Today as we speak, um, we're recording on Thursday today and we're going to be uh, actually delivering the backpacks that many of you have donated uh, to the families and neighborhoods in this community, which is just so exciting. I've been seeing the backpacks in the back of the sanctuary. We, 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 we've fulfilled every single request in terms of a kid wanting to go back to school in this neighborhood through people who put together their own backpacks, but also the money that you donated to help us buy the supplies and now we're going to give them today which is just so exciting so please hear me when i say thank you so much for how you have contributed to kids going back to school in this neighborhood uh just so you know we are we are just a little bit short of the budgeted amount for it so if you wanted to be part of this you can still contribute online to the give page to bannerman backpacks and we're really close so if you can contribute a little bit more that would help us be completely covered for everything that we wanted to contribute to this neighborhood and it's just, I just really want to thank you for the generosity uh, for Bannerman Backpacks this year. I also want to let everyone know where we are with Betta Sue. Uh, I just, it's just kind of exciting to me. I remember when I was part of this drive for the first time last year and 
We as a church covered every single child going back to school in this Betasu community in Liberia. And we, I am excited to announce that we have covered 250 children to go back to school uh, this, this upcoming fall, which is so exciting. I was just talking to John uh, today about this and I'm just amazed at how people contribute to this over and over and over again. The goal for the drive for Betasu was to support 250 to 300 kids and Bethel normally gets close to about 300 kids. We're gonna keep this drive open this Sunday. This will be the last week where we keep it open. And we just ask that if you in any way haven't gotten the chance to par participate or want to participate further and have anything to contribute, uh, please do so over the next couple of days and this weekend as we wrap up this drive in August. And thank you again for how you've really contributed to it because it wouldn't be possible without you. And I'm so excited that we can bless this community and these kids going back to school so far away from us locally here in Bannerman and also globally in the world in Liberia. That's all we have for you today, but I think we actually gave you a lot of updates today. So I hope you read through this, look through the details of everything we've shared. Make sure you fill out the survey if you're a parent, because we really do want to know what uh, you're thinking about for this fall. And may God's grace and peace be with you today.